Season 2 of Apex Mobile has brought us a new map, completely changing the way we play the game. So here are the top 5 guns for this season so you can get more kills, more wins, and rank up as fast as possible. Coming in at the number 5 spot, we have the Longbow. Now this gun was already good before, having a decent fire rate and amazing damage, but now that we have King's Canyon, a much more open map compared to last season's map, World's Edge, the Longbow becomes even better. But even with such an open map, you'll still need a close range killer, and that's where the R99 comes in. Having a monster fire rate and a crazy damage per second, this gun has been good since the beginning of the game and it's not going anywhere. If you can learn to master its tricky recoil, this gun will melt the competition. Now you might think we're done with the close range weapons, but not at all because now we have the Volt. A lot of you might place the R99 above the Volt because of its higher DPS and rate of fire, but the Volt is just so versatile. Because of its easier recoil pattern, this gun becomes viable at longer ranges too. And this gun doesn't slack either, boasting a great DPS and fire rate. So if I had to pick a close range weapon, it's gotta be the Volt. But for a gun to be the best in the game, it can't just be good at close ranges. It's gotta be versatile. And that's why we have the Flatline and the Spitfire. I grouped these two weapons together and here's why. Both guns do the same amount of damage. However, the Flatline can shoot faster, meaning it has a higher damage per second. And it also has a higher mobility, meaning you can move and straight faster. But let's not forget the Spitfire. With the highest magazine capacity in the game, you'll be able to focus on wiping squads instead of reloading, making the Spitfire one of the best guns in the game, especially if you're playing solo. And on the topic of best guns in the game, there's one gun that outshines them all, and I think you already know what it is. It's none other than the P2020. Like, this gun is just so good. It can one-shot kill anyone, and it's honestly just the best gun in the game hands down. Just kidding, it's obviously the R301. This gun is just solid. Not only is it versatile, but it does everything extremely well. It's great close range, it shines at medium range, and it can even spray at long ranges too. This has undoubtedly been the best gun in the game since the first day, and it's easy to see why. Hit that subscribe button, and why not check out this video here? Click it right now.